Six to Fed, Somerset's in the 26. Because his Sonic car is not here, and, and Jason's only been racing part time. And it's a white helmet, so I gotta assume. Stefan's got a white helmet, right? Stefan's family? Yeah, so he's driving the 26, so he's taking over. So no Sonic. Would that be supersonic since it's yellow? So the yellow supersonic 26, Stefan Somerset. Again, it doesn't really depend on the car, it's more the driver. So your top 10 in points. Here is the top 10 in points. We have Kyle Bent. We have the number 26 of uh, Stefan Somerset. Shade of Woods mixed in there as well, along with Travis Atwater, Ashton Sproul, Wesley Sproul, uh, David Bruce, along with Josh Langell, Jeff Vino, and I think Nathan Langell made the grade. He's able to race in this race, king of the dirt. So here's the format, 20 laps. There will be a competition caution at lap 10. The, the, the purse money offering is not in this race. That's coming up in the modified King of the Dirt. And your reigning King of the Dirt champion from 2018 is Josh Langell. He's in that number 18. He just won the feature moments ago here at Valley Raceway. But your champion of the four cylinders in that number 81 again, so your top two in points are in replacement cars. And they're both quite fast. So the way we're doing this, Bruce in the flag stand has numbers. They're going to draw for numbers for the starting lineup here. And once we get that settled out, we'll give you the starting lineup for King of the Door. Appreciate you sticking around this afternoon. I know maybe some are petering home, but we appreciate you staying here and watching these King of the Dirt races. It's going to be a lot of fun with the trucks and eight cylinders and modifieds on track in a bit. And the four cylinders, Trophy, and uh, I got to mention as well, Stefan Somerset is helping out sponsoring this King of the Dirt. So we really appreciate what Stefan does for Valley Raceway. Sitting in that number 26 here. So numbers drawn now for the number two, Jeff Vino. I uh, had a little lapse of judgment. I, I I forgot that Tanner Spinney won the championship here last year because he only raced one race here this year. He's racing Legends cars at Scotia Speed World. Probably shouldn't have said that because I think his family's here as well. So, hello, Spinneys. Was, I was kind of wondering if he would maybe show up today. I don't know. So, looks like... P1 will go to Shaden Wood in the 15, and he likes taking that outside lane. Who will be in position number two? Now remember everyone, 26, that's not Jason Connors. That is Stefan Somerset, and Stefan will move up. He will start second in the King of the Dirt race. In third, it will be the number 12 of Ashton Sproul. He's going to start third in the King of the Dirt race. In fourth, looks like it's going to be Nathan Langell, Josh's younger brother here at Valley Raceway. Fifth will go to David Bruce. Sixth, looks like it will be Kyle Bent in that number 81. Remember, everyone, not in the 14. Thirteen is Travis Atwater. And he will land in the seventh starting position. Well, actually... Scratch that. Looks like Jeff Fino is going to be jumping up to seventh. Eighth will go to Travis Atwater. At the back of the field, it will be Wesley Sproul. And the reigning king of the dirt will be Josh Langell. He'll be starting scratch, starting at the back of the field. 20 laps, competition caution at lap 10. To kind of shuffle things back again. We've got a crown. We've got a trophy. We've got a crown to hand off to someone. Maybe Josh Langell holding on to that trophy for 2019. A little bit of fun to wrap up the racing here at Valley Raceway in the four cylinders. It's been great being able to call these drivers. They've been putting on some spectacular finishes. Drivers are getting antsy here. Getting ready. This is your top 10 in points, so it was tight between the 04 and the 69. Wesley Sproul able to finish out in front of CJ Sink in that 69, so the 04 is in the King of the Dirt competition.
26 to fan. Somerset on the inside. But your leader is the 15 Shade of Wood taking the outside. 20 laps to find the four cylinder king of the dirt at Valley Raceway. It's about to get underway. for the King of the Dirt four-cylinder. Drivers will move out of the way of the tow truck. Right front tire down on the 26th. Jason Connor's car, but that's the fan Somerset driving the 26th, stalled out. Needs a little bit of a push start. Josh Lanchel giving him a shove to the pits. Sounds like the 26 is now under power, but he'll have to pull in. Big shove from Lanchel, so Lanchel will throw the 26 in the pits, and that will probably do it for Stefan Somerset. Big thanks to him for sponsoring today's King of the Dirt races. Top five looks like this. Shade of Wood, Ashton Sproul, Kyle Bent, Travis Atwater, Jeff Fino, then it is Josh Langeau landing in sixth spot, followed up by his younger brother Nathan at the back here. Then it's the 0-4 of Wesley Sproul and David Bruce at the back of the field. Oh, pardon me, David's going to go in front of the 0 4 so He'll line up side by side with Langeau. A lot of people on the edge of the seat for this one watching the King of the Dirt finale here for the four cylinders at Valley Raceway. Base truck moving along again. John's tire and towing. We thank them for their support for 2018 to 2019 at Valley Raceway. They've been around for a little bit. Just think 2020 is around the corner. Usually we kick off the main long weekend here at Valley Raceway. Keep tabs. Valley Raceway on Facebook for all the info, all the details of what's going on. Two laps in. 18 to go, but remember there will be a, a stoppage at lap 10 to bunch them up again. And we're going to pull in that pace truck. Eight laps until the halfway point of the King of the Dirt final here for the four cylinders at Valley Raceway. It's Shane and Wood on the outside. He says, I want to win this race. He's top side. So 
on that number two is going to need a tow out. And we got some great photos of Todd for coming up from Lake Nelson Motor Speedway. So it looks like Stefan Somerset playing uh, musical chairs and cars. He's in the 94 now. I was wondering, Kyle Thompson didn't finish top 10 in points, but that makes a bit more sense. Again, it's dependent on the driver, not necessarily the car. Line them up again here with Shaden Wood in first, leading this race. The number two, Vino's Day. It looks like it's done. Tire coming off the number two. Travis Atwater's going to go underneath the 15. Number 12, Ashton Sproul goes in third. Fourth, Kyle Bent. Fifth will go to Josh Langell. After that, yeah, it's going to take a moment here to kind of figure out. We'll have Dave Bruce go side by side with Langell. Those two cars were battling for the lead earlier. They're, Jerry's kind of looking underneath the I-80. There was some damage earlier. And there's the number two towed away. After Tyre flying off that number two. Two will be toned around turn three and four. It's got to be, a, that's a first at Valley Raceway. I've never seen one driver swap out of cars and keep continuing here at Valley Raceway for King of the Dirt. But I don't think that's going to be allowed. We got the word, 94. Somerset Stay is done. You're not allowed to go into a different car. Nice try, but going to be done for Stefan. But we really appreciate him, everything he's done here at Valley Raceway. But he is done in that number 26 and his number 20, frankly, as well. Here's the two being towed away. Run front, right front tire is gone. It is out of here, going towards the highway. And we restart with three laps in, so seven until the halfway point. Quick caution, we'll make sure it's a quick one to round it out. down to eight cars left in the King of the Dirt finale here at Valley Raceway for the four cylinders. And uh, we'll make them go around one more time here at the Valley's only dirt track. 2019 coming to a close. 2020 will be here before we know it. Again, if you're interested maybe in setting up a car as well, NS Valley Raceway, that's the website, nsvalleyraceway.net. Great resource to, uh, you know, take around and see what you need for your car. Four cylinders, great way to get into racing if you're interested. Always a lot of four cylinders on sale as well at Facebook. But you know, we're always looking for more modifieds, more eight cylinders, more, more trucks for sure. And if we get too many four cylinders, we might have over 20 come next year. We'll see by the end of today's race is at Valley Raceway. We have the 13 on the inside again. He is not the leader. We have the 15 of Shade and Wood still hanging on to the lead for now. And the 12 is on the inside of the 81. Kyle Ben driving that for Owens car. There's the number two feet on the track. He's got a lot of ground to catch up. Great flag is going to go for the race. And it's a big battle up in front. Wood gets in front of that water. Ben right behind the 13. Single foul here in top five as we come around. Side by side, racing for fourth. Landshell underneath the number 
Shane Wood holds lead, and I believe he's going to take that outside lane for the restart. Oh, they're actually offering that same challenge to the 15, but Shaden does not want it. He is not going to the back. No siree for it, Shaden Wood. He wants to hang in first and grab King of the Dirt. Kyle Bent's going to line up side by side in second in the 81. Matt, we're going offering that 81 car to Kyle Bent. 13, Travis Atwater is going to land in third. Fourth will be Josh Langell. Kyle Bent was also offered the same money, 25 bucks to go to the back. If you somehow win, you get 100, but he doesn't want to go for the money. Bruce is back on the track as well, so he'll go to the back of the field. Tinkering the order here at Valley Raceway. I believe the um, number 12 will be in fourth. Langell should be in fifth. That was a top five neon battle. Josh might need a push. I think he's trying to start it up. That 18 may have clunked out here finally. I think he needs a push, fellas, in that 18. So Bruce, I think he's going to give him a little shove to get him back. Sometimes they just need a little push start to get going here. Is he able to fire it up? He fires it up, so he'll have to go all the way around here unless he calls it quits. No, he'll go around, so he's got his work cut out for him to try and get back up in front. He won the King of the Dirt last year. It was his only win last year, but he rounded out 2019 with two wins, one earlier this afternoon at the Valley's only dirt track. With all the cautions and everything, you know who we did not see an appearance by? The water truck. Didn't have the water truck out once today. That's almost a miracle. I don't even think we'd bother to bring it out for the final race here. The final king of the dirt race coming up in a little bit. We have crossed the halfway point, so it is 10 more laps with Shaden Wood in first, taking the outside lane. Kyle Benn, the four-cylinder champion this year. He is on the inside in the 81. 13 is Travis Atwater in third. It's Sproul, Ashton Sproul in the number 12 in fourth. Langell in fifth. Wesley Sproul in the 04. Vino and Bruce, that's your top, uh, well, I guess in this case, it would be your top eight. We did have Stefan Somerset drive in the 26 and Nathan Langell on track, but they are done for the day and not in it to win the crown and the trophy for King of the Dirt.
Shaden will come around here slowly. What a race. Nearly caution free. No cautions in the last part. Race fans, we have a new king of the dirt in the four cylinders. Shaden Wood wins this 20 lap race at Valley Raceway. Somerset's going to come down here at the moment to hand off some hardware. He is just one king of the dirt in the four cylinders. It's Shane and Wood in the fifth. What a race, what a race. He's going to be one excited dude coming out here. He can hear you now. Shane and Wood, king of the dirt at Valley Raceway. He's going to take off his helmet, and Shaden, I, I got to hand you this. We got yourself a little crown. To you, my sir, you are now king of the dirt here at Valley Raceway. It's got to feel good, doesn't it? You just called it a few minutes ago. I did. Uh, that was a good race. Just uh, I'd like to thank everybody who helped me out this year. Roddy Weir, Weir's ATV and Snowmobile Sales. Appreciate that. And all you fans, thanks for coming out. That's it. That's it. That's all it's done. So what do you got to do now for 2019 or 2020 coming up? You got to get some uh, some feature wins under your belt now. I'm going to try. She's a project. <laughs> She's a project. Who would you say was the toughest competitor racing in the four cylinders this year? Kyle Ben. 100%. Any other names? We got uh, Stefan Somerset's going to come out in just a moment and hand off some hardware to you. Stefan and, uh, was in a replacement car as well. Did you think maybe with the replacement cars for Kyle and Stefan they could get up to you? I thought so, but I asked Kyle how that car was running. He said it was pretty good, so I thought his odds were pretty good too, but I just checked out on the restart there and ran my own race. Absolutely. You certainly did check out. We got some trophy and some hardware, and you know what? Turn, turn the, for the logo to be around here. I carefully placed all the logos on the logo of a place that sells burgers in King. Then we'll get us uh, to come over here and uh, make sure to hang on to this checkered flag, my good buddy. Unravel that. So here comes Will Tyson Somerset to hand off the trophy. Congratulations. Let's hear it, everyone. King of the Dirt 2019. It's, it is Shaden Wood. What a win. Good stuff. Good stuff. Stefan Somerset sponsoring today's King of the Dirt races. Stefan, i got to ask you, I've never seen that. I've never seen someone trying to musical chairs in a race there trying to get the 94. Man, I had some bad luck today. <laughs> but it was a fun year for racing. It was a fun year for sure. Congratulations again to Shade. You've done awesome, for, especially for a young fellow. That's what we like to see is the youth coming up and doing it. So. Absolutely. We thank you, Stefan. Thank you very much. We got one more King of the Dirt feature to round out here. Shaden Wood is King of the Dirt in the Four Cylinders.